Yo, what's going on, guys? Today, we're gonna be playing the best Mega Knight deck in Clash Rail. We have Mega Knight Minor Wallbreakers with the Prince. It is also quite good with the Goblin Stein, too, kind of just a natural fit to the deck. But then again, basically every deck in the game is pretty broken with Goblin Stein right now. Ooh, beautiful Mega Knight right there, just jumping straight back to the drill. Guys, I saw some people saying in my last videos how they don't have Goblin Stein leveled up, so if you don't, feel free to play Archer Queen instead or something like Musketeer should work quite well. I'm just going to go for the Minor here on the uh, big guy here, or, or the Doctor, or whatever you want to call it. Man, I think our Minor will actually die here. Man, that's kind of crazy. Didn't even get targeted, but it still somehow died. Okay, Mega Knight should jump on the Doctor soon before he gets a second ability. At least I really hope so. Okay, nice. Oh, the Bandit? Oh, he's going to get his King up. There's no way. Oh, he messed it up. Nice. Okay, he was trying to get his King up right there, but he actually messed up the interactions quite badly. Okay. I think I'll just go for this in the back. I want to go for a Mega Knight soon, but I kind of want that Tesla to wear off first. Guys, some people have been saying that my videos seem a little bit similar to KFC sometimes, so I guess I have to do a KFC impression now. Alright, first I have to do his face. Uh, then yeah, he, he just, um, what's he like? He's like, Alright guys, so today we're going to be playing the best Mega Knight deck in Clash Royale. There's like nothing people can do to stop it. You just go for a Mega Knight in the back, and they can't deal with it. You just take their whole tower. <laughs> And so, yeah, and guys, I also have to make sure I play really bad as well to, to do an accurate impression of KFC. And <laughs> now nah, I'm playing, guys, I'm playing. I don't want to I don't want to see a KFC diss track on me or, or anything like that. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> oh, the Mega Knight, yo. Does this guy not know how Evo Mega Knight works, or does he just have no way to stop this right now? <laughs> what, what in the world? What's happening? Come on, go, go, go. Ooh, we do finally kill that card, man. That card stayed alive for a long time. Okay, wait, come on, come on. Go bats, go bats, go bats. Go wall breakers. Nice, okay, guys, we're punishing him so heavily right now. Nice. Oh, I didn't zap the Evo's skellies, but honestly, I don't think it really matters too much. I'm gonna bats here just to be safe. Okay, didn't really need those, but it's okay. <laughs> yeah, anyways, guys, much love to KFC, man. <laughs> Yeah, hopefully I didn't start anything. Ooh, the one bat alive is alive still and does kill that. Okay, we could get punished a little bit. I think there's no way we stop that um, uh, green monster from getting to the tower. This is going to be a lot of damage here, but I feel like there's no way we lose this at this point. Yeah, I, I don't think so anyways. I mean, we do need some damage still because we don't really have any way to get direct damage, but I think we still should have him in a pretty good spot. Oh, he does go for the poison on offense, surprisingly. I'm just going to go for a minor, and I think we won here. Yeah, there's no chance for him. All right, nice win. All right, we're up against Ja Ja Ja. This means ha 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 in Arabic. Okay, one wall breaker might connect here. I'll just go for the minor in the back. No reason not to. I saw some people saying, well, actually some top players saying that minor first play isn't a good starting play. I kind of disagree, though, honestly. They said, like, minor first play is not very safe. I feel like it is for the most part. Because a lot of the time on top ladder, you also know what your opponent is running. Because you face them a lot of times before, usually. And even if you don't, I mean, minor first play is never really going to mess you up that badly. Like, you might take a few hundred damage sometimes, but I don't really think it could do much worse than that for you. Okay, I don't know if he can actually defend our prince right now. However, we can't really defend him either. Okay, what in the world? He's actually going to defend. Dude, this man just spent Jeff Bezos sum of money to defend and attack. And he's going to get away with everything. Okay, then. Pretty terrible start, honestly. The tombstone's going to be extremely difficult to break through, as well as the Valkyrie. Is going to be quite a nuisance, if I do say so myself. The most important thing here is going to be to keep track of his cycle. So he spent a balloon, skelly drags, Valkyrie since the tombstone. I think. I don't know. I wasn't really keeping track of his cycle perfectly, but from now on I will be. Kind of a terrible situation here, honestly. Uh, just going to have to go for some minor wall breakers. Okay, he's already back to the tombstone. Honestly, I kind of like the fact that the wall breakers are going to go for it because... Now, if he goes for a Lava Hound, we should be in a good spot. Okay, I'm just going to go for this and then the Evo Bats. There's no way he can defend this. He can either Valkyrie or Zap, not both. Okay, he does decide to do that. Okay. We do take the tower down. 
But we cannot defend as of right now. <laughs> Dude, we can't defend. There's literally nothing I can do. Yeah, I mean, I think we just have to accept the fact that our tower is gone here at this point and uh, try to make the best of this situation. Okay. Man, this is rough, guys. The tombstone's just shredding us to pieces. These bats are doing some good work, though, for sure. Hmm. Man, I just... I just don't think we have much of a chance here. He's gonna have to go for a late tombstone. Yeah, he does. I could have zapped quickly, but it should be fine. Okay, come on, bandit. Come on, bandit. Oh, he already got to the Evo Valkyrie. Come on, come on, wallbreakers! Okay, nice, we get a double connection. Come on, let's go, let's go. Oh, no. Come on, bandit, bandit, bandit! No way we got him! Let's go! What a clutch win. Alright, guys, we're in the next one. I'm just gonna go for the split bats in the back. Wallbreakers split are great, but I feel like bats are also quite nice. Okay, I'm just gonna go for a minor here on the tower. Probably gonna be a P.E.K.K.A. deck here. <laughs> I kind of predicted that. Uh, I guess I'll have to go for a Prince on the Ghost. Don't have too much else to do. Guys, a play you can make is to kite the P.E.K.K.A. with the Goblin Stun. It doesn't always work perfect, though. Let me actually try it, just for the sake of testing it. Bro, what an epic fail. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what the heck, man? I just suffered for you guys. Well, I hope you guys appreciate that. Man, I just suffered for your guys' sake, I guess. <laughs> Oh, come on. Tank for the bats. What? Bro, what a useless green goblin, man. That could have just tanked for all the bats. And gotten us some pretty nice damage. We're going to take a ton of damage here no matter what we do. The best play to make here is just to go for this, I guess. I don't know if this is that bad. It kind of depends what he's actually going to get down here to defend our Mega Knight. He's probably just going to get to his P.E.K.K.A. for this. Okay, yeah, this is pretty bad. I'm sure he's going to get his P.E.K.K.A. down here. Yeah, at least the wall breakers do splash the ghost for quite a bit of damage. That is good. Evo Pekka is still absurdly annoying, though. Yeah, I don't think this is good for us at all. Come on, bats. Oh, he actually has arrows. Kind of annoyingly. Okay, why? Why do you just have a random tornado for no reason? Man, these P.E.K.K.A. players and running a random car in the in their deck needs to stall. We actually do somehow defend, though. Do these P.E.K.K.A. players just always have the most random card of all time? And, like, they'll just have the most random freeze that makes no sense, or they'll have... Just, like, whatever you can think of that doesn't make sense, expect the P.E.K.K.A. player to have that. You can, you can best bet they're gonna have that. <laughs> Come on, kill that, kill that. Honestly, that was, that was a terrible play by him. He's gonna probably get a P.E.K.K.A. down, yes, but can he stop our wall breakers? No. Oh, actually, okay. <laughs> I guess that works for him. But not a terrible start for us here. These bats might do some great work, actually. We force out a NATO. That's not bad. I'm going to try to get our Mega Knight down here. I really hope we can get it in time. Come on, please, 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 please. Okay, that's still going to connect, probably. Yeah, it does connect, but not a crazy amount of damage. I'm going to go for a Goblin Stein here. Wait, if he... Okay, wait, 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 wait. This, this might just get straight on the tower. Yeah, that's straight on the tower. Ghost is going to almost die here, honestly. Uh, okay, wait. How do I defend, guys? I didn't think that far. I didn't think that far, guys. I did not think that far. Thought a little bit, but not that far. Why is he not playing his ability? Okay, come on, kill, kill it. Wait, why did he not play his ability right there? He could have just went for the ability and probably won the game. Interesting. Have to go for the wall breakers. Oh, what? I didn't even have to do that. Oh my gosh, this man needs to calm down, guys. I feel like this guy really needs to calm down, honestly. Oh, he does go for the lightning. Wait, he just missed the arrows. Wait a minute, guys. Guys, wait a minute, he just missed the arrows. But he could take our tower at any given moment here, I think. Oh, come on. Come on, go! Come on, please, 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 please. One more, one more! Come on. 
Please, please, we need something. We need something. Go, 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 go. Nice, we get the win. What a comeback there. All right, we found a match. Man, guys, it feels so weird having a face camera and everything now because I remember when I first started my channel, I only had videos with not even my voice. I remember doing my first voiceover video, my first commentary video. That was so funny. I was just sitting at my parents' coffee computer desk <laughs> just recording and like I was, I was talking so slow and everything too. Some people say that I talk kind of fast in my videos. I'm an interesting person in a way because sometimes I talk fairly slow, but other times I talk pretty fast too. Just depends on the situation. I'm also a jokester sometimes, but other times I'm very serious. Alright, I'll go for some split bats here. This guy actually may have Sparky, if not just like... I don't know, some sort of giant or goblin giant beat down deck. Kind of looks like Sparky though. I'm just gonna go for this in the back here because his tower is basically out of ammo. Yeah, I feel like it has to be Sparky. I wonder if a wall breaker connects against Dagger Duchess. Honestly, I don't really know the Dagger Duchess interactions anymore because it's been so long since it's been playable. I feel like these might not connect here, to be honest. I'm gonna guess they won't connect. Oh yeah, they just barely don't. It's kind of close though. Good to know, good to know, because gen genuinely nobody plays Dagger Duchess, so I didn't even know that interaction. I'm just gonna kite this here with the wall breakers. Oh, terrible arrows there, but he's still going to get away with it because wall breakers will die, unfortunately. Hmm. I don't know how I feel about this. Honestly, Dagger Duchess is actually not bad for him because it's pretty good against bats and wall breakers. And then, if we pressure with some heavy units, he has mini P.E.K.K.A. to kill them anyway, so I'm not sure how this will go. Maybe our Goblinstein could be good, though, but mini P.E.K.K.A. is probably going to kind of wreck it. I'll just go for it at the bridge, see what happens. <laughs> you got to try new things sometimes, right? Let's see what happens with this. Oh, he actually goes for a fireball. Oh, I kind of wasted that ability. But hey, he still spent 7 elixir, we spent 7, and we get a ton of damage. So that was actually quite worth it. I would say. I'm gonna Mega Knight here. I don't know how well it's gonna work out. Oh my gosh, no. No, 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 please. Oh, goodness sakes, man, leave me be. Dude, what the, bro, what am I? Like, what, man? <sighs> goblin giant. Goblin giant. Not too happy about this one. <laughs> man, this man hasn't even played as Sparky. Does he even have Sparky? I can't even tell. Wait, hold up. We could actually get saved here by an Evo Mega Knight. Probably not, though, but... Maybe. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, guys. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Come on. Wait, guys. There's no way. Did this guy just have the choke of the century? Wait, no, no, no. Oh, I think I lost. Wait, guys, guys. We just need a zap. Guys, we actually won. This guy had the choke of the century. Alright, we're up against the beach. I do live nearby a lot of beaches, so it's very nice out here, actually. Okay, this guy is the cannon. Doesn't really tell us much. When you used to see cannon, it pretty much always meant 2.6 Arroyal Hogs Earthquake, but now it could really be anything. With the E-Spirit, I still have no idea. Okay, wait, is, is this actually going to be Piggies here? It could be. But I don't know why he would have an E-Spirit, though. Oh, he has Rocket, man, are you joking? Rocket's actually pretty decent against the new card, I guess. Not the best if you split it or put it at the bridge, but in the back it does counter it pretty well. Probably going to be an expo deck, I would assume. Is he just going to let that die? Okay, just go for the last second ability. Hmm. Not a big fan of this start at all. But we'll see if there's anything we can still do. Okay. Bandit is going to force out something here. I don't know what he actually has. Oh, what the heck? Man, what in the world? I don't think that's a great expo at all. There's no way he's going to stop our ability if we have to even go for it. I don't think we do, though. Okay, just a free plus one trade. The new card is fairly decent against Expo, actually. But if they fireball log it, they can basically fully counter, so... They can definitely... Get their way through it. These wallbreakers should force out a cannon, hopefully. Which I don't mind too much. The issue here is I think we do have to go opposite lane. We can't go same lane, otherwise he's going to rocket cycle on our Mega Knights. So this should be fine here. With this Mega Knight. Should be a good Mega Knight, hopefully. 
I do almost want to go for like a Prince other lane and force out the Valkyrie on that, but not really sure if that would... You know, I'm going to go for it. I'm going to go for it. He's probably going to go for a Valk in the middle now. Ooh, he does go for the E-Spirit. Wait, what does he have right now for our bats? Wait, he might have nothing, guys. Dude, he, watch him rocket. Guys, genuinely watch him rocket. Dude, he has nothing. He's so dead. He's so dead. <laughs> he just could not kill Evo bats. There was literally nothing he could do. Okay, I'll see you guys in the next match. Alright, we're in the next match up against an alpaca. <laughs> Hopefully we can do well here. Split wall breakers are probably the best starting play for this deck. Minor first player split bats is pretty good too. Even zap is fine as well. You do want to play in single elixir with this deck, but it's not too bad in double elixir either, to be honest. Alright, I think I'll just go for a goblin stein here. Don't really know what else I would do, to be honest. Alright, since people said I say to be honest too often, I'll say to not be honest. To not be honest, guys. Oh wait, I thought this guy had piggies, but it's actually looking to be uh, just ram rider. Okay. We should be okay, I think, but we'll see. Wait a minute, wait a minute! What are you doing, my guy? <laughs> huh, I don't know why he just did that. Why did he just take a bunch of damage for no reason? I'm not really sure. He did not have to do all that. Okay, pretty good start here. His defense is actually really strong, so it's kind of nice to get some early damage. Just gotta keep our Mega Knight at the ready, because I know he probably has a Ram Rider. I guess I'll go for a Bandit, just to get some value out of these bats here as well. Okay. Oh, nice, the bandit actually dashes still. Oh, go bandit, go bandit, go bandit, go bandit! Man, bandit, you silly goose. That's okay, though. Miner should kill this firecracker. Oh, nice, the... Oh, no, no. Okay, nice, we do kill the Evo Skellies. Uh, he's probably gonna get a really nice ability, though. Dang it. Or will he? Huh, he actually doesn't go for an ability, at least not right away. Okay, kind of interesting choice right there. Oh, the Mega Knight is on the tower. Wait a minute, what is he doing? <laughs> what is this guy doing? This guy's the king of misplay. Dude, what are you doing? What is this guy genuinely doing? He had, like, twice in a row he just did this. You can miss, you can miss one chance, but you're really gonna miss two like that? Okay, Firecracker's de definitely gonna get a lot of damage here, but, uh... I think we're fine. Yeah, we're definitely fine. He has no delivery or anything like that. It's not like he has that Piggy's deck with all that... All that uh, crazy defense. He does have pretty crazy defense anyways, but not as hard for us to break through. Nice, okay, yeah, I think we definitely won here. Yeah, okay, really nice actually that we can beat the number one deck in the game pretty much right now. Which is this Ram Rider deck apparently. Alright, I'll see you guys in the next match. Alright, we're up against a Minecraft YouTuber. Probably gonna have to take down his dirt house. His dirt shack. <laughs> Man, guys, I actually kind of enjoy Minecraft, to be honest. I haven't played it in a minute, but it's always nice every every quarter of the year to start a new world with friends. <laughs> yeah, my, my friends play Minecraft, too, at least once in a while, but I don't know. I feel like they always join the world. We always play a lot, but then we just uh, stop playing after that. I'm the only one who actually used to grind it, but nowadays I'm also just more focused on Clash Rail, to be honest. All right. So this guy is Royal Hog's Earthquake, for sure. Which is actually probably going to be difficult. I'm not even joking. I actually lost this matchup earlier when I was playing Piggies, but now that I've played it a few times, I realize that Pigs actually probably has a good matchup here. One of the main reasons is the new card being super broken against our deck. Wait a minute, let me go for this here. Oh, dang it, man, he went for a late ability. I was hoping he would just forget to play the ability, if I'm being honest. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Whoopsie. Oh, there's no way. There's no way they still... Bro, come on. Goodness sakes, man. Evo Skeleton's moment. He's probably gonna go for pigs very soon, too. We have not much to stop them. Probably gonna have to go for, like, bats and, a, and you know, a prince or a bandit. Cannon is gonna destroy our deck, too. Not feeling too good about this one, if I'm being honest, guys. You can see, like, it's gonna be really awkward for us, even though we have Mega Knight for piggies. It just... I don't know. Okay, I, I guess I'll go for the bandit here on this thing. I think we're just going to have to wait until he makes some sort of mistake, which is going to be pretty hard for him to make that bad of a mistake that we can actually punish him much for it. I think I'll just go for a Mega Knight here. He's probably going to go for some piggies. Can't do much about that, though. 
Mega Knight was kind of our best play here. Okay, he actually doesn't go for piggies. Which I guess is nice for us. You know, maybe I could have split up... Oh, get that off my tower. Maybe I could have split up the Goblinstein. Not really sure if that would have been a great play or not, though. It would probably just be an okay play, I guess. Wouldn't really do much when it... Or, I don't know. Okay. We'll see if he goes for a delivery on that other side. Oh, no. Wait, guys, look at, look at the right side. Look at the right side. Oh, nice, he missed the delivery. I mean, he goes for it, but he doesn't hit the doctor, though, fully. I mean, it, you know, you guys know what I'm saying. Like, the recruit didn't stab the doctor. Okay. I do almost want to go for a Mega Knight at the bridge. You know, I'm going to go for it. Might not be the best play ever, but shouldn't be the worst either, I think. Dang it, man. My my stuff is already kind of dead. But look at our miner, though. It's going to go to town on the tower. Yo, Prince. Prince, Prince. There's no way. This guy just lost. Wow, there's no way. Wow. <laughs> Man, what a what an insane clutch up right there. Okay, I think we got him. Good game.